Hello everyone, welcome to ATDI. This is Anis and in this video I would like to demonstrate to you how to create a Flutter file or .sol file from SIP files using ICS map server. So in order to do this, uh, let's open up ICS map server. Then go to this option, create blank matrix from two corners select save file from the panel get corner form now here you select the save file that you have in this example there are several save files that I have and I want to start with the airport save files now here we have already read in the corner information in meters now the step size is the resolution and I want to say it to be 10 meters let's create this blank matrix I want to create a folder for blank matrix and it needs to be 16 bit ICS file I'm gonna follow the file name coding of the clutter type like airport the grid code and the resolution and save this file here now the grid code for this particular data is 4 UTS 48 and this I got from the source of this file there is a tutorial on how to generate grid code and please have a look at that if you're not sure on how to get the grid code uh, easily so let's create this blank matrix once this blank matrix is created we want to open this matrix by going to disk option control treatment then open memory session we want to cancel the first pop-up open this file and now we want to overlay the vector that we have in that save file okay so only there is only one parameter and we want to use it as an altitude and again the grid code is 4 UTS 48 okay now next thing we want to do is we want to give it a clutter code how do we do that we press this button here transform values we want to select all the values except minus 9999 which represents a void value in this uh, map server and then set it to 1 In doing so, I've set the values to 1. After this, we can see that all of this value has become one value. That way, we have clutter coded this particular clutter, that is airport, to code number 1. Now, let's save this. Yes, we want to save this. I want to go inside this place, blank matrix, and save it on top of it. All right after doing this let's close this yes we want to do the same thing to all other clutters so first we go to create blank matrix from two corners select the save file main roads step size again we have to be consistent with the step size create blank matrix we want to create 16 file let's rename this so it's main road alright let's save it grid code again for UTS 48 create once blank matrix is created you go disk option control treatment open memory session cancel the first up pop up window then go main road open you rasterize okay select main roads to select the vector select the particular uh, variable use altitude again you need to mention the grid code 4 UTS 48 to press ok and there you go those are the main roads and all but this set value to 2 okay and we 
think is set to 2. So let's save it. Once we save it, we gotta close it. And again, we repeat the same process for all the different save files that we have. I'll I'll complete all the process and then show the end result to you. Now, for for the sake of making this video small size, so what I have done uh, ha is that. I created um, IC2 file from all of those saved files uh, as I've showed before and so here we have it six different uh, clutter files or six different clutter types so now what we need to do is we need to combine these together to form a single clutter file to do this go to disk option now we create our big matrix so create blank matrix from file list so you do 16 bit file list so select all these files we need to create a 16 bit file as well so let's call it clutter okay let's call it sample clutter save that's right we have grid code already mentioned here because it reads from those matrix that's it this blank matrix is big enough to accommodate every one of those files so let's now go to insert files select our big blank um, big blank matrix that is sample clutter that is the destination file this insert file function what it does it, it it inserts all the vector from the source file to the destination file and we want to select all the source files that we have basically okay I opened everything up even itself and what I want to do is insert all data but not no value data so that means not blank area now let's do insertion once we did ins do insertion, then it has inserted all the values, clutter values in that big file. So let's open up that file. And here we have it. All the clutter files are in there. Now, now what we need to do is convert this 16-bit file into 8-bit file because our clutters are 8-bit file let's select this sample clutter 8-bit file save uh, let's open this sample clutter file so this is our clutter file and we can see different color there representing different uh, clutters We should have an airport up here somewhere. Yes, we can see that. So we have different colors represented, and that's exactly what we want in our clutter. So here we have created a clutter. Now we want to go to back to that folder, and this IC1 file we want to rename it to dot sol file. then we have finally created our clutter file from a safe file thank you very much for your attention and take care